What's up guys and welcome back to the Superhero Buzz, where we cover the latest in everything comic book movie related. I am your host Noah, and in this video, I'm going to break down a new update for No Way Home, and according to this source, the future is bright for Toby and Andrew, and they could also be getting their own solo movies after No Way Home. But first, if you could, hit that subscribe button so you can get the latest buzz on everything comic book movie related. This will also qualify you for my new giveaway, so watch till the end of the video for the rest of those details. Anyways, there's quite a bit to unpack, so need to say more? Let's dive right in. By now you've heard the rumors surrounding No Way Home, and there's been a lot of speculation about Toby and Andrew. And so far, we have two villains returning for the sequel, with those being Doc Ock and Electro, and they just so happen to be from different universes. So at this point, it's pretty safe to assume that No Way Home will be a Spider-Verse movie, but we're still waiting for the official announcement, which according to Mikey Sutton will be happening on Good Morning America, though further details have yet to be revealed. And so today, we can now take that a step further, because according to insider Daniel Rickman, both Toby and Andrew will be returning in No Way Home, and they're set to have significant roles in the movie. But it gets even better. They could also be getting their own solo movies after No Way Home, which will be considered continuity to No Way Home. So in other words, both Toby and Andrew might be getting their own sequels. But it apparently depends on the success of No Way Home, and more importantly how well it does in the box office, which in that case I'm not worried about. Now if you recall, this also lines up to another report from Giant Freakin' Robot, where they reported on Sony wanting Toby back for another movie, which would work as a spin-off to Doctor Strange 2. And considering that Sam Raimi will be directing, it would make perfect sense. And it would also explain Toby's involvement with the movie, and potentially Spider-Man 4, because in the multiverse anything is possible. Finally, he also confirmed the main villain for the movie, William Defoe's Green Goblin. Now if you've been following my channel, I've covered a few plot leaks for the movie, and they all seem to have one thing in common, William Defoe serving as the main antagonist. So should his reports turn out to be true, this might lead to further implications in the MCU. Perhaps William Defoe will return for not only No Way Home, but also Spider-Man 4, because like I said, in the multiverse anything is possible, or in this case the Spider-Verse. But having said that, what are your thoughts on this, and are you excited for No Way Home? Sound off with your thoughts down below. Now let's get into the giveaway details. I will be giving away the first exclusive Superhero Buzz t-shirt that is now available in all sizes, and all you have to do is give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. As always, thank you so much for tuning in. I will catch you next time. 